the pure Awaniki. Took the D-O-G-O-U-T, fought by my friend. She committed suicide last week. Can't stop thinking of the final moments. She is only 23. Her dad found her hanging. Me and her, we met at Red Hot Chili's and watched them together in ecstasy. You'll stay with me, Bree. You, me, Alex, Millsy and Sophie. We were all so happy. There was never any doubt in my mind that you were a special one. Alfonso, Mango and Bergamot. The pure o anarchy slashed the mural of the one big divided family. Drowned in a tide of, drowned in a tide of, drowned in a tide of misfortune like Mallory. Resistance, it was said, is futile fallacy. Useless paraphernalia, still undeveloped in extended juvenilia. Scars on his palms, when breath becomes air. Tropicalia, it's forbidden to forbid. We will kill today the old foe that died yesterday. Let's all get with the program and start following the program. Skipping work, not telling her cause she'll go berserk. Roaming the Stratford Centre, learning how the undesirables lurk. Sweet are the uses of adversity, red battle hardened artist Bobby Baker giving Bobby Bravo Bravo the cargo to go one further than Fargo. This is a true story. The events depicted took place on all seven continents. Forever. Without request of the survivors, the names haven't been changed. Out of respect for the dead, the rest has been told exactly as it occurred. Tarib. Tarib. People inside, people inside, people. Shell after shell. Russian dolls. Vodka alcoholics. Stereotypes. Dogma semiotics. Stereophonics. Two transmission channels. Pressed into histrionics. Too many transmitted channels. Transmuted. Hoping to be a doer of remarkable things. Sitting in, sitting in, wondering what wondering brings. 55.5 Dub Street. The Pure Anarchy.